quick video, I'm going to show you the two simplest ways to cut perfect circles with a plasma cutter. Keep watching. The first method is super simple, and that just involves wrenches. They come in a million different lengths, and you can get most bigger sizes that you need from, you know, circles that are six inches, maybe even down to five inches, up to two feet in diameter with most standard wrenches. All we need is a sheet metal screw. Take a sheet metal screw. Or if the metal is really thick and you don't want to use a sheet metal screw, you could use, um, you could just tack weld a nail. There we go. Then we take our wrench, whatever size wrench we want to do our radius. Take our plasma cutter. Say we want to do this, we'll do double. I mean, this is going to do a circle radius that is about eight inches. If we went with a little teeny wrench, um, this is going to do about a five inch circle doesn't really matter. All we're going to do is take our plasma cutter and it just sits there and it just rides in there. Even with this where it doesn't actually fit in there, that just gives you a space. I'm just pushing force against the screw and against these two little jaws the whole time. You use a larger one and I'm just going to set it in this even when it's bigger. There's enough of a goalie in there just to let it rest, It'll give you whatever radius you want, even if it's humongous, we can do it. We'll cut out a couple little radiuses real fast, just to show you, and then I'll show you the other method, a little more precise, but still super simple. It's almost like they planned it and made them staggering sizes almost perfectly. You can use regular wrenches, ratcheting wrenches, double box, double open, doesn't really matter. Uh, hey, you wanna see how to make this cool organizer for your toolbox? I'll show you how to do that in a separate video. Check the link. But what happens when you wanna get really small holes, you know, smaller than your wrenches are doubled, um, you know, double the length of it. So the three inch, four inch holes, stuff that's probably a little too big for a hole saw, but your wrenches aren't short enough. I'm gonna show you how to make a quick little jig to be able to make some nice radiuses. So to make a more precise jig, all we need is a chunk of scrap steel. Don't get one too long. You know, I probably wanna, I mean this right here, like this is gonna make, it's gonna make an 18, you can make 18 inch diameter radius. This right here is about five inches. It'll make, you know, an eight inch. So this is a tip to my plasma cutter. All I need to do is cut a hole for, so it can ride just right in here. I don't want it to ride on the bigger surface, just a smaller surface. It's about a half inch hole, just so this slides in there with just very little slop. So I actually need to make a donut for this. I need a piece of sheet metal that sits up about half inch around this. Not important, but so all I do is take my diameter here. And so we have our tip through here, we half it. And then I will just mark where one hole is and I'll just drill a hole here. And then I'll just mark where the outside is and just drill it there. So I want this donut in here. So I just marked it out with the compass real fast. Just so I have a pencil line, drilled a bunch of random holes in here, just the same size as a sheet metal screw. And I just lined those up and I kind of staggered them so you can move it in and out a little bit. And that looks about right, right there. And we'll just attach the sheet metal screw. That's it. And this spins, make sure it's not gonna get caught on anything. And then um, the inside is scrap and the outside is scrap. So for the inside, I'm gonna feed in like this and the outside I'll feed in like that. Um, because I'm cutting a donut, I'm actually gonna leave a gap. So I'm gonna leave like a little tab here and here. So I'm gonna start here, come around, stop, start, stop. You'll see.
Ah, that looks good. Here we go. Perfect. Exactly what I wanted. There, I cut out two just to show you how their production, you can get them identical over and over and over again. Come on, get it. Come on, that's as high as you got. Come on, you can get it. Oh yeah, you're getting there, come on. That branch is low, come on. No? Come on. Come on, come get this one. Come get it. Get it. Come get it. Come on. Yeah. Get it. Get it. Get it. Get it. Oh yeah, you got it. Good job.